as Orissa continues to burn a top mouse leader of the state has come forward and said that they were responsible for killing VHP leader Lakshmanan Saraswati. But the VHP isn't buying their claim. Meanwhile, the Orissa chief minister has hit back at the center for pointing fingers at its efforts to stop violence in Kanthamal. Orissa's most wanted Maoist leader, Sabyasachi Panda, has come on local television channels to claim that his organization is behind the murder of the VHP leader Lakshmanand Saraswati, the incident that sparked off the current anti-Christian violence in the state. But the VHP is not buying his claim. Meanwhile, Urissa Chief Minister Naveen Patnaik is taking the centre head-on over the Kandamal issue. Patnaik met Governor M.C. Bhandare, but he maintained that nothing was discussed on imposing President's rule in the state. The Chief Minister has also shot off a stiff reply to Home Minister Shivraj Patil, in which he reminded the centre of its own failing in controlling terror. The letter said, and I quote, The country is facing serious situations threatening the life and property of its citizens in various states, such as Jammu and Kashmir, the Northeast and other Naxal affected states. The terrorist strikes in the very capital of New Delhi itself must have put much greater strain on our resources. It is therefore not the time to point fingers at the effort of the state government. The Home Minister wrote to me yesterday, there were a lot of errors and unjustified, unjustified points made to that, so I have clarified the point. After being at the receiving end for quite some time, Chief Minister Navin Patnak has finally reacted tough on the centre. But the question remains, will the Chief Minister also act tough in Kandhamal and will he be able to restore peace in the district soon? In Bhubaneswar, Jajati Karan.